work with my mother to sell fruits and vegetables. It's fun most days, but hard work. Got a lot of steel to shape. God be praised. Feeling sick? I work with my mother. So I spend a lot of time at the market stall so I can learn the merchant's trade. Got some good pieces. Hmm. Blades, helmets. 
pretty much anything to suit your needs. Don't forget to check inside the shop if you need anything. I don't claim to be the best in life run. Yorland Greymane's got that one. Man Steel is legendary. All I ask is a fair chance. Dragon's Reach. I help my father. Take a look. Check inside the shop if you need anything. It's not easy being a woman in sky. It's no fun getting pushed around. To our elven overlords, sharing the heavens. With man? Ha! They can barely tolerate our presence on Earth! Today, they take away your faith. But what of tomorrow? What then? Do the elves take your homes? Your businesses? Your children? Your very lives? And what does the Empire do? Nothing! Nay, worse than nothing! The Imperial Machine enforces the will of the Dalmor against its own people! So rise up! Rise up, children of the Empire! Rise up, Stormcloaks! Embrace the word of mighty Dalos, he who is both man and divine! Trust in me, White Brother. Trust in Heimskirk. For I am the Chosen of Talos. I alone have been anointed by the Ninth to spread his holy word. Talos the Mighty, Talos the Unerring, Talos the Unassailable, to you we give praise. We are but maggots, writhing in the filth of our own corruption, while you have ascended from the dung of mortality, and now walk among the stars. 
But you were once man. I, and as man, you said, let me show you the power of Talos Storm Crown, born of the North, where my breath is long winter. I breathe now in royalty and reshape this land which is mine. I do this for you, Red Legions, for I love you! I love, love, even as man, great Talos cherished us, for he saw in us, in each of us, the future of Skyrim, the future of Sandriel! Ain't this is a
to end this little <laughs> Thank you.
down before anything else shows up. Yes, the claw. I know how it works. The claw, the markings, the door in the hall of stories. I know how they all fit together. Help me down and I'll show you. You won't believe the power the Nords have hidden there. Does it look like I can move? You have to cut me down first. <laughs> it's coming loose. I can feel it.
Trouble? Careful if you cross the river to the east. Old Hatch for Iron Hand and his brigands are holed up in the middle. You see? The terminology is clearly first... Ah! The Dragonstone of Bleak Falls Barrow! Seems you are a cut above the usual brutes the Jarl sends my way. You'll have to see the Jarl about that. Maybe his steward, Avenici. I'm sure one of them will pay you appropriately. My associate here will be pleased to see your handiwork. She discovered its location by means she has so far declined to share with me. So your information was correct after all. And we have our friend here to thank for recovering it for us. You went into Bleak Falls Barrow and got that? Nice work. Just send me a copy when you've deciphered it. Barangar, you need to come at once. A dragon's been sighted nearby. You should come too. A dragon? How exciting. Where was it seen? What was it doing? I'd take this a bit more seriously if I were you. If a dragon decides to attack Whiterun, I don't know if we can stop it. Let's go. So, Irileth tells me you came from the Western Watchtower? Yes, my lord. Tell him what you told me about the dragon. No, oh, that's right. We saw it coming from the south. It was fast. Faster than anything I've ever seen. What did it do? Is it attacking the watchtower? No, my lord. It was just circling overhead when I left. I never ran so fast in my life. Not now. I thought it would have come after me, for sure. Good work, son. We'll take it from here. Head down to the barracks for some food and rest. You've earned it. Irleth. There's no time to stand on ceremony, my friend. I need your help again. I want you to go with Irileth and help her fight this dragon. You survived Helgen, so you have more experience with dragons than anyone else here. But I haven't forgotten the service you did for me in retrieving the dragon stone for Faringar. As a token of my esteem, I have instructed Avenici that you are now permitted to purchase property in the city. And please, accept this gift from my personal armory. I've already ordered my men to muster near the main gate. Good. Don't fail me. Help Irileth kill this dragon before it can attack Whiterun. No. I can't afford to risk both of you. I need you here working on ways to defend the city against these dragons. As you command. One last thing, Irileth. This isn't a death or glory mission. I need to know... I'll see you at the watchtower as soon as... Don't worry, my lord. I'm the very soul of court. The Jarl is, as you can imagine, splendid. There's a house available right now. Wonderful. Here's the key to your new home. The task of stu- is more important than you realize. I'm kept so busy. I don't get to see my daughter as- I'll be glad to help. And of course, now. What would you like to purchase? Very well. Is there anything else you'd like to purchase? Very well. Is there anything else you'd like to purchase? 
Very well. Is there anything else you'd like to purchase? Very well. Is there anything else you'd like to purchase? Very well. I'll make the arrangements. The next time you visit your house, your new furnishings will be in place. Is there anything else you'd like to purchase? Very well. I'll make the arrangements. The next time you visit your house, your new furniture. Is there anything else you'd like to purchase? Enjoy your visit to Dragon's Reach. enchantment but keep studying you've only Scratch the surface. in the filth of our own corruption, while you have ascended from the dark of mortality. Now, you, lady, could you spare a coin? Really? Do you, do you have a place I could live? Oh, wow. Are you, are you sure? Yay! Thanks, Mama. I promise I'll be the best daughter ever. Take pity, lady, and spirit. The gods and dragon reach say you painted the yard. Come to chat with an old woman. What are you looking at? I'm not afraid of you. No. Even if you are my own. I don't claim to be the best looking to protect yourself or deal some damage. Don't forget to check inside the shop if you need anything. It's... It's everything I could have hoped for. I... I know it's not much, but... I found a few pretty things. They're in the chest in my room. If you see anything you like, please, take it. You've done so much for me. It's... it's the least I can do. Thank you. 
something up there. Oh, I wish I saw that first. You're so lucky. big tree in the park looks so sad. I feel sorry for it. Wow, thanks, Mama.
Look, you've already been told you're not allowed here. Turn around and go back the way you came. We're causing no trouble. All we ask is to look for her. I don't care what... signs of any dragon right now. It sure looks like he's been. I know it looks bad. We've got to figure out what happens. Believe it. You're dragonborn. In the very oldest tales, back from when there were still dragons in Skyrim, the dragonborn would slay dragons and steal their power. That's what you did, isn't it? Absorb the dragon's power. There's only one way to find out. According to the old legends, only the Dragonborn can shout without training, the way the dragons do. That's right. My grandfather used to tell stories about the Dragonborn. Those born with the dragon blood in them. Like old Tiber Septim himself. I've never heard of Tiber Septim killing any dragons. There weren't any dragons then, idiot. They're just coming back now for the first time in forever. But the old tales tell of the dragonborn who can kill dragons and steal their power. You must be one. You say you're left, being awfully quiet. Come on, you're left. Tell us, do you believe in this dragonborn business? <laughs> Some of you would be better off keeping quiet than flapping your gums on matters you don't know anything about. Here's a dead dragon, and that's something I definitely understand. 
Now we know we can kill them. But I don't need some mythical dragonborn. Someone who can put down a dragon is more than enough for me. You wouldn't understand, Housecar. You ain't a norm. I've been all across Tamriel. I've seen plenty of things just as outlandish as this. I'd advise you all to trust in the strength of your sword arm over tales and legends. That was shouting what you just did. You must be. You really are dragon. You there. The We're looking for someone in White Run. Take good money for it. I'm the commander of the guard here in White. Finally here. The Jarl's been waiting for you. So what happened at the Watchtower? Was the dragon there? I knew I could count on Irileth, but there must be more to it than that. Dragonborn? What do you know about the Dragonborn? Just the men. The Greybeards seem to think the same thing. Masters of the Way of the Voice. They live in seclusion, high on the slopes of the throat of the world. The Dragonborn is said to be uniquely gifted in the Voice. The ability to focus your vital essence into a thune or shout. If you really are Dragonborn, they can teach you how to use your gift. You heard the summons. What else could it mean? The Greybeards. Didn't you hear the thundering sound as you returned to Whiterun? That was the voice of the Greybeards, summoning you to High Rothgar. This hasn't happened in centuries, at least. Not You've done a great service for me and my city, Dragonborn. By my right as Jarl, I name you Thane of Whiterun. It's the greatest honor that's within my power to grant. I assign you Lydia as a personal housecarl, and this weapon from my armory to serve as your badge of office. I'll also notify my guards of your new title. Wouldn't want them to think you're part of the common rabble, now would we? We are honored to have you as Thane of our city, Dragonborn. Rangar, calm yourself. What does any of this Nord nonsense have to do with our friend here? Capable as she may be, I don't see any signs of her being this... What? Dragon. Fear not. Come dragon or giant, we'll be ready. The Jarl has appointed me to be your house, Carl. Lead the way. I'm right behind you. I am at your command.
You lead, I'll follow. I can take you to any of the hold capitals. Where do you want to go? <sighs> Climb and back and we'll be off. I can't wait here forever. at your own peril. The way is dangerous and the gate will not open. You shall not gain entry. Oh, forgive me. Most who arrive here do so because they have heard of the college beforehand. This is the College of Winterhold, a safe haven for mages in Skyrim, a place of wisdom and arcane knowledge. What is it you expect to find within? Ha! Huh. Humor is often in short supply here. But I sense that perhaps you're after more than just that. It would seem that the college has what you seek. The question now is what can you offer the college? Not just anyone is allowed inside. Those wishing to enter must show some degree of skill with magic. A small test, if you will. No, I'm afraid I don't know anything of the sort. Excellent. The Mage Light spell is useful to any mage, not just those specializing in alteration. Can you cast one on the seal on the ground? No? Well, if you think you're capable of it, then I'd be happy. Or you can try your luck with one of the court wizards around... Here you are. Now I'm anxious to see you cast it. Winterhold's glory days may lie behind it, but the college lives on. No matter what, the college will endure. Well done indeed. I think you'll be a superb addition to the college. Welcome, apprentice.
I'll lead you across the bridge. Once you're inside, you'll want to speak with Mirabel Irvine, our master wizard. Please, follow me. Rather clear. Yes, of course. I'm simply trying to understand the reasoning behind the decision. You may be used to the Empire bowing to your every whim, but I'm afraid you'll find the Thalmor received no such treatment here. You are a guest of the College, here at the pleasure of the Archmage. I hope you appreciate the opportunity. Welcome to the College. Another new student. I'm surprised at how many of you there are lately. Well, first you'll need these. While you're not required to wear them, you may find them more to your liking than your current clothes. I'll give you a brief tour, and then we'll get you to your first class. Are you ready to begin? Wonderful. Please follow me, and don't yes, wander off. Of After I finish showing you the grounds, we can talk. The dominant feature here is the Hall of the Elements. It's our primary location for lectures, practice sessions, and general meetings. The Arcanium is located above the Hall, and the Archmage's quarters above that. While technically in charge of the College, the Archmage's responsibilities often keep him occupied. Thus, I run the day-to-day -day operations. Now, if you'll please follow me, I'll show you the living quarters. Unfortunately, we've had to implement more stringent entry procedures due to some problems with the local Nords. We don't anticipate any real violence, but it never hurts to be prepared. Our newest members are housed here, in the Hall of Attainment. I'll ask that you please keep your voice down while inside, as others may be working on research or delicate experiments.
showing you the ground. Now I'll show you to your quarters. You're going to be sharing space with your fellow apprentices, who you'll meet shortly. This is where you'll be staying. This is Force! the place for yours. Please try and be considerate of others. Initially, you'll be learning from Tolfdir, one of our most esteemed wizards. Force! After I finish showing you the grounds, we can talk. Tolfdir is likely already addressing the new apprentices. Go on in, and if you have any... Please don't bother the Archmage unless it's absolutely necessary. We're just beginning. Please, stay and listen. So, as I was saying, the first thing to understand is that magic is, by its very nature, volatile and dangerous. Unless you can control it, it can and will destroy you. Sir, I think we all understand that fairly well. We wouldn't be here if we couldn't control magic. Of course, my dear, of course. You all certainly possess some inherent natural ability. That much is not being questioned. What I'm talking about is true control. Mastery of magic. It takes years, if not decades, of practice and study. Then what are we waiting for? Let's get started. Please, please. This is exactly what I'm talking about. Eagerness must be tempered with caution, or else disaster is inevitable. But we've only just arrived here. You've no idea what any of us are capable of. a chance to show you what we can do. You've been quiet so far. What do you think we should do? Is that so? See, she agrees with us too. Why don't you actually show us something? All right, let's settle down. I suppose we can try something practical. In continuing with our theme of safety, we'll start with wards. Wards are protective spells that block magic. I'll teach you all a ward, and we'll see if you can successfully use it to block spells, all right? Would you mind helping me with the demonstration? Are you at all familiar with ward spells? That's all right. I can teach you a very basic ward, one that's enough for the purposes of... Now, if you'll just stand right over there, I'll cast a spell at you, and you... Look it with the ward. Here we go. Over there, please. Just opposite me. Wouldn't want anyone else in the way. Now, cast the ward spell, and keep it up. Still here. All right, what is it? What do you need? Okay, got it. Anything else? Hold still. So 
coming for us. Well, I think this is an excellent start. I'd like you all to continue practicing with wards, please. I think perhaps we're ready to begin exploring some of the various applications of magic throughout history. The college has undertaken a fascinating excavation in the ruins of Sarthor nearby. It's an excellent learning opportunity. Suggest we meet there in a few hours and see what awaits us inside. That's all for now. Thank you. Good to see Skyrim still has such fine... Do give an old man... I've been looking for you. Got something I'm supposed to deliver. Your hands only. Let's see here. A letter. Not sure who from. He wouldn't say, just that he was a friend of yours. Looks like that's it. Got to go. I guess it's all clear now. And here we all are. Shall we step? All right. Please stay close to me while we're inside. It should be safe, but it's always better to be cautious.
I find it hard to believe this excavation. As some of you may know, Sarthor was one of the earliest Nord settlements in Scotland. Elves in the infamous Night of Tears, not much is known about what happened to Sarthor. This is an exciting. Well, are there any questions before we begin? Ah, yes. Hmm. Well, why don't you see if you can assist Arniel Gain? He's one of our scholars, here working on cataloging our finds. I expect he'd appreciate some help in locating any additional magical artifacts here in the ruins. Any enchanted items will do. The usefulness of the enchantment is irrelevant. If you find anything, the class can look it over. Now let's see. What shall we have the rest of you do? Raylina, my dear, why don't you search for warding magics? Anything my designed ancestors to destroyed the homes of Arnold's ancestors. So much bloodshed. I'll be amazed if we find anything useful here. He what? You must be one of the new apprentices then. Fine, fine. Just... Just don't make a mess of my work, all right? I've only looked through a portion of this section. You, uh... You can look around in the chambers just north of here. Try and be careful, all right? We don't want to damage anything. Just round up the rest of the magical artifacts so that I can catalog them. Until next time. What in the world was that racket? Is everything all right? How in the world did that happen? Really? Perhaps the amulet is important somehow. Is there some way you can use it? sure what to expect here. Please be on your guard. Oh, 
Hold, mage, and listen well. Know that you have set in motion a chain of events that cannot be stopped. Judgment has not been passed, as you had no way of knowing. Judgment will be passed on your actions to come, and how you deal with the dangers ahead of you. This warning is passed to you because the Sigic Order believes in you. You, mage, and you alone have the potential to prevent disaster. Take great care and know that the Order is watching. I... I swear I felt something rather strange just then. What just happened? I'm afraid I didn't see anything. Can you tell me more about what you saw? The Sigic Order? Are you quite sure about that? That's very odd. And danger ahead? Why, that doesn't make any sense at all. The Sigics have no connection to these ruins. And no one's seen any of their order in a long time. Perhaps we should take a look inside these coffins. Now, please do be careful. Who knows what we're going to find? Take a look. Simply fascinating.
I'll try to drain some of its power. Oh.
We're here to teach you a lesson. Never should have come here. Do your work. Just give up! <sighs> <sighs> 